Hey everybody, what's up? Jester here. Welcome to episode 79 of our Idle Heroes free-to-play series. Last time, if you were here, you saw the final evolution. We hit two massive, massive milestones. As far as I'm concerned, one, we got our E5 penny. That's right, we jumped from an E3 to an E5. Get wrecked. And two, nope, wrong one we now have a 10 star carry we went through we got our 10 star um dark athenor we got our five pieces of carry and we converted the two so that's kind of where we're at now kind of that 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 low idle uh got a few things to check out today uh gate of the void i i know that only opens up hey we got the uh we'll do that Claim all. I know that only opens up once you get your E5, um, and I have not opened it yet. I could have done it throughout any time throughout the week. I chose not to because, well, this whole account, everything about this that goes on is about this playthrough. It's about here on YouTube, so I didn't. One thing that did happen is we did complete Celestial Island, and as you can see here, we started a new quest. This one will net us, when it's all said and done, another nine star dark, and so on and so forth. But it's gonna take uh, just over a month, about five weeks. Um, but what does that mean? That means we got us a nine star light hero and the six star light hero that we've already had in the bag. Which means that's pretty close. Can we actually I don't even know if we can 10 star those, if we can evolve them. So I don't have any dummies. So I don't think that we can. But I'm okay with that. I'm I'm I, I'm okay with that. Uh, we can use that if we want to use that to make a, a, a nine star into a ten star. Currently we have none, but we will be working on Heart Watcher here to add her to the team, get her up to ten star, so we already have that nine star waiting. Uh, let's see here. You're a six. You're a six. Also want to start working on that. Somebody had said in the comments uh, a few episodes back that Unimax was a, a pretty good build. So we'll do that. Speaking of speaking of comments, uh, somebody was like, if you give me that account, I will make that account funny. You've obviously never watched my streams and seen what I look like when it comes to funny. Uh, that being said, I, I've put so much time in this. Why would I give this account away? Why would I give it away? Not gonna happen. Anyhow, check out the events for the week. We do need to finish, ooh, actually hop in here. Loot, 80 more. Uh, I did, uh, feels bad, man. I did forget some of them, but I got uh, a good chunk of them. Um, I kinda want this Bell Rain skin, cause I, I think that's kinda cool looking. We are using her, gives a little bit of attack damage uh, attack bonus and damage reduction. I kind of want that. Um, or we're going to get the orbs, which we can get, what's five of them? What are we looking at currently? 35. You know what? Screw it. Live dangerously. Do what we got to do. I'm going to get the Bell Rain skin because why not? Deal with it. It's cool looking. I like it. I like it. So, nah. And then we're going to go 90, says what, 45? And give us a little bit of gold. Value package, this is free to play. Another package, Imp's Adventure. So we will start next week's video by running through this, seeing what we can get. Um, but for now, we got the shelter mission. Um, a couple of cool ones, couple of cool ones. And then we got us a scary and a, um, can't remember your name. Can't remember your name. Asmo, Asmodel. That's not scary. That's, um, sleepless. Nope. Mim. God, I'm failing left, right, and center. Uh, I've seen teams with this one. What's her name? Uh, Elvia or Olivia, excuse me. 
Um, and, and they do fairly well, so we might have to look into that. Uh, and then, of course, we have Shia. I don't know who you are. Ithaqua? Okay, so except for Shia, these are all some of the newer ones over the last period of time that I have not gotten to know yet. Uh, here's a question. Here's a question for you, for you folks that like to comment. Of these three, which should we build? Which of these three, if these three, should be built? Doesn't mean we're going to. Does not mean we're going to. Just if we do, which should it be? So an assassin for you, an assassin for you. Mage, and what are you, priest? Is that what their wings are? And I have no idea. So I will have to go through and we will see the fruits at the end of the week, um, which will add to the, what's it called? Um, Imps Adventure. So, and then Grey Dwarves, we're, we're not working on that. Um, I suppose, yeah, because we, we have a full set of six star, I think. Think, Penny, do you have a full six star set? Yes, you do. So we do have those. We're working our way towards there. But the thing I'm looking forward to, the thing I want to check out today, is Gate of the Void. Um, Compass of the Transcend, Obelisk of Heroes, Void Temple, Realms Gate, and Evolution Cube. Um, so you take a Shia and a whole ton of that and you get Sword Flashia or Scarlet Queen. Hmm. Conversion. So you need some of those, you need those, or you need those. No idea. I haven't seen any of those yet. Let's see here. In the Evolution Cube, you can use Crystals of Transcendence to convert your heroes into Transcendence ones. And we have Queen and Shia currently. For the heroes, uh, for the heroes that are to be converted, there are no requirements on their level or stars. So obviously, I it seems like a five star would be your best bet. Converted heroes will gain new skills, stats, and appearance, and their faction will become transcendence. Transcendence heroes will inherit their original enabling level, stones, equipment, artifacts. If the hero is equipped with the skin for conversion, the skin will be automatically returned to your skin inventory. All right, compass. So, like you see, like you can see, I've picked up a few of these. Compass of Transcendence. Uh, after fifteen draws, you you are guaranteed Transcendence spheres. All right, in the Compass of Transcendence, you can use Cores of Transcendence to summon all five star heroes. Cores of Transcendence can be earned from marketplace or packages. Yeah, I've I've picked up a couple. There are two summoning methods, Compass, Fate, Compass, Guidance. Each summoning has a chance to earn you Transcendence, Transcending Sphere. It's singular, and that kind of worries me, because you need like 5,000 of them. Um, guidance, after a specific number of draws, you will be guaranteed a sphere. Okay. Once you've obtained some sphere, okay, seeing it's, it's, it's plural, singular plural, you can tap in... Tap the conversion in the top right to convert into Crystals of Transcendence or Stellar Shards. Um, so we got... So you need a total of 15 and you're guaranteed. We have five. All right, we'll have to come back and check that out. Obelisk of Heroes. So what is this? Is this like Battles? I'm not even, I'm not even ranked. I have 10. Hall of Fame. Um, yeah, not quite sure. Obelisk of Heroes. Okay, you are ranked. An E, an E5 is 50, E4, okay. So, Fortress, yeah, I've got 50 points because I've got the E5. 
this person has 510 points. What's even scarier is this person has 3,190 points. I have 115. That person pays into it. I wonder who is highest on the list in Jesus in, in terms of free to play. That's what I want to know. Seal land, Tower of Oblivion, campaign, broken spaces. Seal land. Interesting. Clear stage 20 of the Shadow Faction. We're at. Th so you get bonus? Oh, okay. All right, tower, clear story 350, okay. To increase heroes max in Gate of the Void. All right, all right. So this, this, I guess we got, got to do the tower now. Um, Aspen Dungeon, I'm on Nightmare, yeah. And that'll take me probably there. Fantastic. Campaign. I don't think I've touched the campaign in a while. Um, so this actually gives you a boost. Okay, so now that this is opened up, I'm going to get gold and spirit bonus by 60% here. And broken space is to increase the... Okay, you got to clear stage 7. I'm a long ways from that. Um, expand the level cap of all E5 heroes by 5. All right, so... I guess now all my E5s are higher. Um, what does the tower do again? Interesting. All right, let's check out the realm's gate. Whoa. I'm going to go with Shia. Start exploration. I don't know what I'm doing. Void inventory. You got nothing. Click on the button. Some void creatures were reported to be seen here, although not in large quantity. Stay sharp. Okay. Abyss. What the crap is this? Yoink, yoink. Huh. Sure. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Pick a monster. There we go. Go. We win. Okay. This is how we can go about. Get oh, all righty. All righty. I can get down with this. I just got to figure out where those things come from up here. And do you recharge? Battle. Go forth and, and do your, do your, do your worst. Um, uh, activate the portal. Okay. Come here. Come here. Let's see what we can do. So this should be it, I believe. This should... Oh, defeat! Battle again. Victory. Portal activated. Okay, so they added a new mini game. Levels one of five. Do we get anything? We still haven't gotten anything. Smash. Each limbo energy lasts one minute in Smash, and Smash will end up in the current map as is cleared or all your energy is used up. So I could legit go splat. Path planning enabled. Nope. Um, okay, so I'm gonna have to figure out what these mean. That looks like a chest. Um, possibly boss, boss type stuff. Doesn't give us a legend. Void consumption. Uh, void corruption, excuse me. Void corruption determines the stats of your opponents. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Shadow heroes, so if you're you so I'm gonna get a bonus because I'm using a rainbow team. That's right, nerds. There's a method to the madness. Not really. <laughs> Alright, Gru. Let's see what you let's see what you got. Splat, that's what you got. You ain't got squat. 
battle. Defeat. Oh, no. Let's try it again. Victory is mine. So this is probably what's going to happen. As we continue to build up our team and make it bigger, better, better, and, well, in my case, bolder. Can you get more bold than I am? I don't think so. All right. Um, can you cannot be? Yeah. These are fortress heroes, which is awesome because we have a fortress five star, or excuse me, a fortress E five. So this should be Penny's chance to shine. Shine like a diamond. Oh, no, it didn't shine there. You got wrecked. Not the second time. Alrighty, so looks like this is going to be all, yep, all Abyss. Okay, we got defeated the first time. Um, I should actually probably pay attention and to see who's doing what kind of damage. And determine it that way. Like it appears that that one uh, lays 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 a beat down. Also, this one right here, uh, I don't remember the name. I, I keep seeing that popping up, and it's just beast mode. So I would not mind working on one of those. You know, I would not mind. Uh, you know what? No, we'll skip it. We ain't got we ain't got that kind. Of, yep. Like see, oh, and I should have just clicked on it, but no, I'm dumb. Victory, yeah, see, 14 mil. And that's round two. All right, why, why am I pushing on this? Because I want to check this. Some treasure is hidden in the area. Explore it by your adventurous spirit. Battle, give me your stuff. Give me your stuff. Open, and it costs... Okay, you can pick what it is. Uh, I don't need that right now, so I'm not going to open it. We're gonna we're gonna save our stuff so we can do some more stuff because stuff needs to be done. Battle fourth and check you out. No thanks. Complete all events. Do you actually have to open, or do we have another bad guy? It looks like we actually have to open them. Well, crap. Not not the biggest fan of that because it's forcing you to use it. Yep, sure enough. All right, interesting. Um, path planning enabled. Oh, I can determine my own path. Yay. Um, nothing in here yet. So what I'm going to do is we're going to check out the smash feature. Because why not? We only got 100 more. Boom. Go forth. Uh, are, are, are you serious? This is going to take... This is going to take a minute. Literally. Or two. So yeah, that's my cue. Um... <laughs> Uh, I, I will keep a recording of what happens at the end because I have no idea what's going to happen. Um, and actually, you know what? I know what I'll do. Screw it. Oh my god. That was the largest waste of my time absolutely ever. But an hour and 40 minutes later 
I'm gonna go back in here. Cost a hundred of the the things we got. We got dick for gold. Um, seventeen hundred of whatever the stellar shards. Um, and then twenty three hundred of the crystals. And, and wait, seriously, we were here. That got us three spaces. We do have seventeen more. Yeah, no. Um. So we have five of those, forty nine hundred. We need what five thousand? Is that what they said? You know what? Push the button. See what happens. Eyeball opens up. Nothing. Oh, select a hero. Okay. Um. Now let's check this out. Hero preview, 0.9%. So is this kind of like swapping nerds? You're gonna put one nerd in and get one out? Like you have a 0.09% chance to get a mem or an ADA or something like that? Let's find out. Do we, do we have a throwaway? Um, sure. we go with you. Uh, Ormus, what are you going to do for us, dude? Nothing happened. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, I, I, I'll thunk him for... You know what? We're going to go with Belrain. Does this mean we're going to get a Belrain? Nope. Uh, summon. Whoa. Draw a constellation to summon heroes. Ooh. Um. I have no idea. I got an Ent Elder. Okay. Um. Wait, is it legit constellations? <laughs> This is not gonna lie. This is kind of cool. Uh, what, what are you gonna give me? A transcendent sphere. Okay. All right. I'll have to do a little bit more uh, shenanigans. Conversion. Uh, I'll have to check this out just a little bit more to see how that works. Um, however, does this mean? I, I can get me, I, 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 no, that's, no, because that's 500, or that's 5,000, thousand, so no, that's not the case, okay, see, that seemed a way too easy, um, so, so we got a long ways to go, uh, I'm not sure what this does, uh, not just yet, I'm gonna have to do some, do some YouTubes, and maybe when I come back. Um, so it doesn't say what this is. Um, we are working on Penny. Where's Penny? Penny, Penny, where are you at? There. Um... No clue. So I got to figure this out. Uh, I'm sure somebody will, will, if they make it this this far, will kind of give me a clue in the comment section because that's kind of what happens, isn't it? Um, oh, there's another spot over here. Starts. What are you? Um, first encounter. Can we claim this stuff? Yeah, I can. Oh. I can claim it. Okay. Uh, I don't know why I'm able to claim it, but it's 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 gems. Okay. When the first player clears designated er designated areas, so Eddie, 
a uh, huge, huge shout out to whomever Eddie is in his level 298 god tier, whatever the crap. Um, Obelisk of Heroes, is you, aren't you like the Hall of Fame? And Eddie is not that person. Okay. Uh, is Eddie in any of these? Huh. Jester's not. Hell no. He's ranked 115. Because he's a nerd. Any Anything else? Coming soon. So it's got spots being brand new. Okay, that's that's how you go back. Neat. Did another one open up? It. No, I just did claim that one. Um. Yeah, I have no idea. So this is kind of like uh, what the hell's the name of it? In arena, uh, interdimensional arena. Yeah. All right. So we'll see what this is about, and maybe when we start the next video. Um, we will know more. Anyhow, this was an um, elaborate waste of time. And if you are still here watching this, you are the true rock star. You are the true hero of the day, and God knows why you're still here watching this, because I don't know. Anyhow, um, we'll see what happens. Uh, this is always the most boring of the weeks, because we have to wait till the very end to see how it pans out. With both the uh, Imp's Adventure and the Shelter Mission. Anyhow, um, I hope you all have a great week, and I will see you next time.